And we're back with more Breath of Fire. We've scoped out Windia. But now we're going to ask some kids about some stuff. Looking for someone? Ugh. I know what that is. You're playing hide and seek, aren't you? Um. So that's a Japanese trope you'll see in anime. It's a teardrop thing that basically says, What the fuck are you talking about? You have to try and find us. Great. Ready? Go! Well, let's go look for him. You're looking for Tipo, right? And he's a kid too, right? So maybe these kids will know something about him. So... There you go. I didn't want to be found, now I gotta be in. I never thought anyone could find me here. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> you got me! Whoops. And I think the last kid is... Right there. Main kid. <laughs> How did you find me? I remember when I first played this game, I did not notice the the button you could use to do that, and that's, I had to scour the entire fucking place to do this. You play it long enough, you just know how to do it. You're pretty good at this game. Have you played it before? I don't know. I've had it for 23 years. I wonder if I have beat this before. Thanks. Maybe you can help us. We're looking for some friends of ours. Have you seen them? Hmm... Uh, well, a little while ago, a robber broke into the house over there. And that robber was a kid about your size. And what happened to him? What happened? He got beat up by the owner of the house and took off. I think maybe he went down the road. What do you think, Ray? Or Ryu? Could it be Tifo? <laughs> and Ray on the brain. Thanks. We'll try looking over there. Come on, Ryu! Ow! Got beat up by a robber the other day. And I taught him a thing or two. That robber sounded like some good-for-nothing kid from the country. Well, that's mean. Labeling all country folk as bumpkins, that's mean. I used to live out in the middle of nowhere till I moved to the city. Mostly because I moved with my parents, and they moved to other places, and I stayed here. So, we're in Central India. This area is directly below Nina's room. Okay. So, these things aren't to be worried about until later. You see a pleasant-smelling field of flowers. So, you can go back into Windia... Go over here. You'll actually find a master, but uh, suffice it to say, he uh, he's only there to teach you something to get you another master. It's kind of dumb. Eggnock. The primary road connecting east and west Windia. <laughs> This is the entrance to the road. There's a small hut over there. Let's go and see if the mo the owner has to say. Okay. We've got ourselves some enemies. Yeah. That should take care of them. There we go.
Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna use defense form. Yeah. Uh, that didn't sound good. What do you got, people? You got clothing! Oh boy! Stuff I can sell, and... Ryu! Don't try anything, my little lizard friend. Good move. You see, there's no use resisting, punk. We don't really care about you anyway. But things would get messy if you ratted on us, so we can't chance that. But it'd be even messier if we tried to kill you and you turn into a dragon again. Don't worry. We've got it all figured out, see? Enough talk! Say goodnight! So yeah, this is becoming a trend. This is becoming a trend I'm not really fond of. Get mole. See, it says it right there. Ugh. Okay. Couple of characters from Breath of Fire 2 making a cameo. And we're in a pub. Hey, it's the foreman dude from the mine. Or someone who looks like him. The pub falls. Okay, fall. They're all yours. <laughs> I just gotta keep an eye on him, right? Yeah, just keep your eyes on him. And your hands off the bottle, okay? We got better things to do than worry about a couple of kids. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Fall. I'm trying to mimic it. Okay, brats. You'll get yours when the contest is over. For now, just stay there and behave yourselves, okay? You better take it easy too, Gar. Oh, he big. The contest's coming up, you know. And of course he's drinking. Are you? Are you alright? If only we could get out of here. Huh? Chew through them? No, I don't think so. They're too thick. Uh, how'd you do that? Um, you bit all the way through them. It's amazing. I mean, now we can get out of here. Who needs rope trick when you can do that shit? Uh, um, eh. Looks like they're gone. That guy named Falls here, but it looks like he's had too much to drink. If we're quiet, we might not notice us. We'll be okay as long as we're careful. Yeah, you don't want to mention the other big guy just standing there? Let's go. So, in other games, this would be a stealth minigame, but it is a cutscene. Thank Christ. Uh. Yeah, <laughs> you. Where do you think you're going? I see his eyes perk up. It's like, uh, nowhere. We're not going anywhere. Nowhere. Nowhere. That's right. We'll be seeing you. You get back here, you... Never mind. We made it. I knew we could do it. Okay, let's get out of here before he, find, before he wakes up. Is that what they're calling sobering up now? Okay. So, talk to this guy. I'm not goofing off, I'm handing out flyers, see? Well, I turn him into a mobster, I guess? I don't know. Yeah! Yeah, see? So, uh... So these guys are... 
Charging extra for the contest? What makes you think I would do something like that? Who do you think I am, Paleo? So these guys have items. You've got a flyer, then you've got a discount. Cool, so that's gonna help. Hey, you've got a flyer. You get a discount for that. So these guys are basically the same as Manilo. And I want that, but I can't get it. And I want that, but I can't get that either. I'm feeling kind of dumb. I should have grabbed that instead, but this is all the stuff you can grab later. I'm not so worried. So this is Genmol. So the whole gimmick with these guys, and they're bunny girls, who knew? So the whole gimmick with this place is it's home to a fighting tournament called the Contest of Champions. And um, we're going to be dealing with that. You kids here for the contest? Didn't know kids like this sort of thing. So they, they're doing registry and all this stuff. It's really hard to predict the odds for the contest. Everyone's in it. It's a good fighter, you know. Whatever. It's not like any of your predictions are right. Jesus! <laughs> Way to be mean there. I'm the manager of the arena. But the contest is run by some other folks, see? So, that's why I'm here selling tickets. You know, gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. So, Bailey and Sunder... They won't be here for a while. They're busy getting ready for the contest. Why? You need to see... No, 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 no. So, yeah, they, they run the contest of champions and do their own thing. And everybody's kind of here just waiting around for it. I got another bum. <laughs> I've been cheated. I thought there was going to be big girls, but all there was was little girls. Uh, it looks like he didn't appreciate our star attraction. She's usually one of everyone's favorites. Um, uh, show tent, huh? Wonder if they got big women in here. Know what I mean? Oh, you perv. I normally don't wander around in this city, so. Oh, God, this place is just wrong. Anyway, I've got enough money for... There's a lot of unmentionable types here, but I guess they're all here for the contest. So I will save. I don't need the money. I'm not worried. But this will be our base of operations, at least for now. Got a sort of big dungeon. Let's save. I mean, not big, but... If I remember, actually, the shield I was mentioning is actually on this mountain. Because we've got another mountain to climb, and who knew? So. That was Gedmull. We're making lots of headway through this game already. But we'll be back next time.